Hi YouTubers, I'm going to make a video today showing a system that I came up with to easily put a fitted sheet on a camper mattress that's tucked in a corner somewhere or, or restricted so you can't get at the corners easily. In our case, the mattress fits between these two closets here. There's about two or two feet or so from the face of the closet to the corner of the mattress and it's just impossible to get back in there to put the fitted sheet on. So the, uh, the secret to this method is uh, a simple piece of quarter inch paneling. It's cut in length to about approximately the width of the mattress. And it's about the, the width of the piece of paneling is about as uh, wide as the mattress is deep. Uh, I cut the corners round so that the sheet wouldn't snag on them. And then I went around along with a, a piece of sanding block, sanded all the edges and corners down nice and smooth so that the sheet wouldn't snag on them. Now, now you take the, uh, the head end of the fitted sheet, find the corners where the seam is, put that corner right at the end of the piece of paneling. So you want the seam right here near the near the corner so it fits in that pocket and the edge of the uh, sheet should be down near the bottom of the piece of paneling. So you got this one in the, the corner there. Now I'll have to go around the other side. I'll have to scoot in front of the camera here because the space is rather restricted. You want to slide the mattress down an inch or two away from the wall so you've got a little pocket back there. Now you find the other corner of the head end of the sheet. Uh, right here is the seam. Bring that over to the other end of the piece of plywood. So now the plywood kind of fits in the in the pocket there at the head of the of the sheet. You then take this, slide it up toward the top of the bed, just drop it into that pocket. You can then go around the sides of the mattress. Slip your sheet down around the side there. Back down to the foot of the mattress, push it back up against the wall, continue going around and putting your sheet on. Again, I have to scoot in front of the camera, but I apologize for that. Slip the other corner onto the bottom end of the mattress and you go around the side and pull that down. Now I leave the uh, I leave the piece of paneling in place there. It uh, also helps to hold the uh, the fitted sheet onto the mattress so that it doesn't slide off, doesn't come off while you're sleeping and uh, it doesn't hurt anything for it to be back there. When it comes time to remove the sheet, it's also very simple. You uh, just pull off the pull off the bottom corner. Oh, I got the mattress pad there too. I'll put that back on. I just screw it off the bottom corner. Go up along the side. Pull back up a bit. Scoot across here in front of the camera again. Slide the sheet down a little bit away from, or slide the mattress down a little bit away from the wall. Take the other corner off. Just reach up there. Pull out the piece of paneling. 
slip it off the board, and you're done. I'm 75 years old. I struggled with this for better than 10 years, wrestled the mattress around, trying to get it on there back and forth. I even rigged up a rope and a pulley on a, another camper that we had to try and pull the bottom end of the camp of the mattress up so that I could reach around the top. But this is very simple. It works for me. I hope it works for somebody else. And uh, thank you for watching my YouTube video.